Hello everyone, welcome to the huge wasteland of grey that is the world that I am manually mining. Yes, I am manually mining an entire Minecraft world and today, after a, a series of crazy episodes, let's go back to something a little bit more relaxing than smooth. There is a huge cave down here where are aquifers, so I think it's a great idea for us to start actually mining on this area, flattening the mountain, and maybe we can expose a little bit more of the massive cave that is below it. I actually started many many episodes ago in this area over here, so yeah, let's, uh, let's go back into this area and mine it a little bit more. There will be a multi-layered cave over here, so it's not an unidimensional big hole that we are going to do and that is probably going to make it very very cool and indeed there we go, you can see that there are re-entrances and other places where the mobs are, I take that uh, small hole over there is where the... yeah, it's the other thing that we are exposing, so it's shaping to be a very cool exposing cave episode and I would actually uh, want to kidnap your attention for a couple of seconds before moving on I am trying to make a community Q&A uh, and that uh, implies that I need to gather questions from the community so if you would like to see one question, if you would like to question me about anything just go to the comments, leave your question and I will feature it in the uh, video soon enough. So uh, yeah, if you want to make questions to me, take the chance and uh, do it, just do it. Setting up already the logistical parts for the next segment, I brought uh, yet another beacon to be able to reach those areas, but I, I would like to give you a better view on, uh, on what we have done so far, there we go, it's pretty cool, and the mountain is, is really hollow, because for instance, if we go over here, can I do my trick? Yes, I can, I, I don't know why, but I quite enjoy a lot uh, fly through the arches. So, it's basically a big hollow mountain that we have over here, so there is still a lot to uncover, a lot to expose. Let's push a little bit more and uh, let's uh, save the rest for later episodes. As you guys can see, there is at least some uh, rays of sunshine reaching the aquifer down there and when you actually take a big look from how it was, there is clearly a big difference. There is also two very interesting things that happened today. First one, uh, we surpassed the day 7500, I don't know why I missed that, and actually 
if we do uh, the trick that uh, we have now with the stat, the stat and okay okay i b better not be fine with the elytra i am very clumsy <laughs> but okay if, if we put stat show we can see that we also passed the 14 million and a half blocks mined in total big progress as well on that front having a small look on the statistics there we go nothing too big to notice now since the last episode but after two big metrics on the days and on the total blocks i mean i i suppose we are all very very happy so thank you so much for watching guys i really hope that you are enjoying and uh, yeah i really hope to see you on the next one